Welcome to clickmyproject.com Now I am going to explain the project blood donation system. Abstract Blood donation management system is a software application to maintain day-to-day day -day transactions in a blood bank. The software helps to register all the donors, blood collection details, blood issued details, etc. It has a big plan to collect the blood from many different sources and distribute the same for the needy. A blood donation management system is a cache or bank of blood or uh, blood components gathered as a result of blood donation, stored and preserved for later, uh, later use in blood transfer, uh, transfusion. The term blood donation typically refers to a division of a hospital laboratory where the storage of blood product occurs and where uh, proper testing is performed to reduce the risk of tra transfusion related events. This application is built such a way that it should uh, shoots for all type of blood banks in future. So every effort is taken to implement this project in this blood bank on successful implementation in this blood bank. We can target other blood banks in the city and then existing system. In existing system, the blood bank that store the information about their blood level stacks and the type of the blood available in blood bank. In the existing system, the high cost is needed for storing and maintaining the blood stocks. In the existing system, you need a blood building for strong storing a blood. So sometimes the blood stock may be damaged. The requirement of blood donor when compared with other countries is very less in overall blood donating percentage annually. However, the users feel weak and lightheaded for several hours following the procedure. There is no proper care for a person who donate blood to patients. That is, the medical history about the donor is not available within the websites. And then disadvantages of the existing system doesn't maintain huge amount of records and then it will take more times. And then proposed system. The proposed system is entitled blood donation. It is developed using Microsoft Visual Basic 6.0 as a front end and then Microsoft Access as the back end. The basic purpose of the system is to accommodate and maintain the records of blood donor list. Only uh, VB and Oracle needs to be installed in the required center machine. Currently, the records are stored manually as the user accustomed uh, to Windows environment. VB as the front end and provides user friendly. As the required hardware for the proposed system is already present with the organization, we need to install only specific softwares which will support the working of the proposed system. The new system will operate feasibly and will contain an automated database for storage. And then advantages of the proposed system, time consumption will be less. Customer won't have to wait for a long time for the blood. Everything will be very fast instead of handwritten. No calculation problem as it will be done by the computers. A proper database will be generated avoiding the use of register and books. A proper and managed detail of each and every customer will be maintained. Customer satisfaction will be good, which will in turn uh, lead to a faster growth in profit of the blood bank. Now I am going to explain the data flow diagram. First of all, we start the project and then the admin will enter the uh, project and the admin will log in using the username and password the admin uh, this also the uh, the blood bank management system fully uh, full fledged is using the admin process um, first of all the admin enter and then uh, they are uh, adding the donor list uh, if uh, if the do if any donor list is not available so delete the donor details of the donor and then update the donor and then end process now I am going to explain how to run the credential management project. This is the login page. This page requires username and password for entering to uh, entering and do further process the username and give the username and password. And then click next button. This will be redirected into this page. This is the title page. And then click next button. Then this page will be processed. And then 
Next, it will show the MDA form. Then select the details uh, of the MDA form. This is the donor details. Then add the donor details. Give the donor ID, donor name, age, address, city, and select gender, uh, select blood group, contact number, reference number, and also date. That will be selected in the date picker. And add. If you uh, add the new, new data, then you have to add. Otherwise, you have to uh, delete the record. If the donor is not in the list, then you have to delete the record and update the details and also edit the details. Record is updated. This is the update detail. Then edit the data. This data will be edited. Record is edited. After uh, view the report, you have to add the path data source name and also open the uh, read write mode and then give the username also and this is the report for the for this report contains the donor details of the id name age gender and the blood group and also contact number and also date and thank you